Good evening and welcome to this new live stream. Tonight we're not playing The Incredible Machine 1, we're not playing uh, even more The Incredible Machine, or also known as The Incredible Machine even more. No, we're not even playing The Incredible Machine 2, nor are we playing Sid and L Amazing 2 Machine. Tonight we are playing the thing that came after that, that's called The Return of The Incredible Machine, also known as Contraptions from the year 2000. But, before, but of course, as an introduction, we'll be starting at the very first game, just for a few puzzles as a warm-up, then jump on to the next ones, and then we're gonna play The Return of the Incredible Machine. I hope I turn on my microphone, <laughs> because that's something that I tend to forget. And we are live streaming from the laptop. We're already having some technical difficulties, because the shout-out app is not working somehow maybe i use i should restart this machine over here oh that's makkelijk gaat dat tot uit zo makkelijk and i have to reconfigure that one in a minute or two when that has been rebooted for now everybody welcome and lovely that you are joining on this horrible horrible cold monday night Ga je nog aan of ga je gewoon knipperen? Kom op! Haha! <laughs> Lovely! I think it's booting. I'm <laughs> not sure. <laughs> Alright, lovely. Let's start with the very, very first game. Let's see if I can get it to work. But before we start, let's welcome everybody. Hey, good evening, Kent Imaginarium. Laura Wolf Peterson. Hansel Chan, Dad, Aquitics, Skelket, Jenkins Mum, Dragon Skull, Hansel Chan! Did I already say? Yeah, I already said Hansel Chan. I tend to, to name people twice in this. And I think. Oh, and Arthritis and Smash Dash and Sarnaz. Everybody, welcome and lovely that you're joining tonight. I assure you it's gonna be a lot of fun as soon as I can get this thing to work. Oh, it didn't even reboot. No, no, no. It went to sleep mode. And now it's back. Is it working? I think not. First Gickelijk spell. Yes, I've been posting videos of Planet Strike. And so I will uh, uh, post videos of the whole game. So be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you haven't already, click the like button of this live stream and bounce it. Like IP conflict. Well, then we have to memorize all of the. Oh, that's gonna be horrible. The Mexicalian. Alright, as I was saying, as a quick introduction, let's start by playing the very, very first. Let's see if we can get it to run. The Incredible Machine. There we go. Let's open up the games folder. Sierra. The Incredible Machine number one. There we go. Stop the music. Phew. All right, doesn't even fit perfectly, but that's okay. Oh, it's a little bit sped up, but... Burn into your brain. Alright, let's do a few puzzles as a warming up. Alright, so... It's based on Rube Goldberg's design. You have to... Well, you, you've been presented a puzzle. And parts are missing. So all that you need to do is... Put in the new parts, the missing parts. So the bowling ball will scare the the mouse inside the treadmill, the treadmill will roll the conveyor belt, yada yada yada, there we go, that's the first puzzle. Advance to the next one, let's do three of them. Alright, same concept, mirror what you see, there we go, hop, easy peasy. Alright, one more, before we continue on to the next game. Hey Ultravin, hey Aquitics, 
Hey, Alex McAngels, shout out's not working. Let's see if I can do a shout out. Maybe I've done a shout out, I don't know. Yes! So I think you get the concept of this game. This is an easy beginning. And you can use the parts, all parts that you like. So we can even choose not to use that tennis ball over here. Try it again. Wait, it barely hit it. Missed it. There we go. So that's how the incredible machine works. Gone. I'll show you what the incredible two machine two is like. Which is more of the same. Wait, before we do that, before we do that, oh, that intro. There was even a The Incredible Machine even more. And that one must be run on the Microsoft Windows. Thanks, game. Maybe it works like this. Eh? No, 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 no. And there we go, The Incredible Machine 2, listen to this. Cheers everybody. Phew! Sierra! You know, we could sure use a little light in here. Much better. Hi, I'm Professor Tim. Welcome to the Incredible Machine 2. <laughs> Who has things like this? Um, it appears so that my save game is still in here. Alright, mid tutorial, there we go. All you have to do is mimic. Man, I must have done puzzles like these a hundred times. Maybe even more. Maybe even more. Get it? Even more? Alright, one more. Two more. Oh yeah, the buckets. You can decide how full the bucket is, by the way. So if I do it like this, it won't go up or down. But this means it's more heavy. Look. It's just about as heavy as the bucket on the left side. Oh, almost the same. Alright, one more. Ah, they tried to teach you the difference between... Uh, different kinds of ropes. So, the hedge clippers... And these scissors... I'm not even sure what this is called. The thin snips, because these are tin lines, these are normal ropes, and... The tin snippers will snip all, well, both kinds of ropes, I guess. Hop. But it's not the other way around. Um, physics are quite a bit better on this game, Jenkins Mum. Indeed. Oh my god, I was just thinking about this puzzle earlier today. Last one, then we'll switch to the game we are playing for the rest of the evening, don't worry. Zeg ik dat goed? I don't know. Um. So you got Bob the fish, this is Bob, oh Bill, Bill, his name is Bill, sorry. And if you break his fish tank, that means that Curie the cat will come for it. See, they'll be lured by it, oh my god, first attempt, that's, that's really good. Alright, and like thousands of more puzzles on that. And. Honestly, if you ask me, The Incredible Machine 2 is my favorite part of the Incredible Machine series. But tonight we're playing the same game as The Incredible Machine 2, but a little bit refurbished six years later. What does that look like? I can show you. Are you ready? I am. First, fix my window size a little bit. There we go. No, 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 we skipped the freaking intro. 
I want to hear that intro because this is the new Shira intro. It's a bit short. Phew, Shira. But it doesn't disappoint. Look at this animation right here. The gears, the light bulb, everything is in the game, but I've never seen that hand. Welcome to the return of the incredible machine contraption. Hi, I'm the professor. I'm speaking to you through this loudspeaker because one of my experiments went wrong. I'm currently radioactive and I don't want to contaminate you. Now, I've assembled dozens of contraptions for you to complete. If you can solve them all, then I'll know you're the one who's got what it takes to be my apprentice. Just choose where you want to go by clicking on one of these signs here. <laughs> Good luck! Yes, Ultravin, next Monday night I'll be playing Raymond Legends! Man, I'm gonna play new games! Hoo hoo! Well, they're considered new in my book. Alright, let's sign in! Because I haven't played it yet on this computer. You cannot remove the guest profile, though I had to try. Alright. There we go! Yes! And yes, they redid all of the music as well. Well, you probably heard some of the amazing audio tracks on the background of my live streams before. Will I be needing help? Of course, Raiden, I can always use help. Alright, I think it's just time to start playing, right? It's 2015. I'm not talking about the year, I'm talking about the time. There we go. Hi, I'm the professor. If you're playing this, this is probably your first contraption. If not, you can turn me off by clicking on the done button. Click on next to hear more or back to hear previous instructions. This takes about two minutes. Done. Knock the eight ball off the screen. Please click on all of the pointing finger hints and read them before you start. And I think that's the reason this game is so huge because uh, every goal is read out loud. We're gonna hide the hints because I can get you through, <laughs> well, at least half of the game without, without even looking at my screen. I played this so many times compared to other games that I played during a live stream. This is closer to me. All right, let's see if we can play a shout out. I have to guess the hotkeys. Yeah, I can't even see if I can do it. It's not working. Let's see some shout outs. Um, well, I've seen that, so I know that one for sure. Ah, oh, Will Houston, I haven't seen Will tonight. No, I haven't seen Wolfbane. No, I haven't seen Alex. I haven't seen Hector yet. Hmm. Nee, that is a ook niet. <laughs> Let's just continue on playing. And I have to have my chat right here. Hi, Isaac. Good evening. So, as to demonstrate to all of you guys, if I press start, the machine will start in time. And as you can see, they lined up a few balls. And all of them have different properties. I'll start it again. As you can see, the bowling ball is quite heavy, just like the pinball over here. And you got the soccer and the basketball. Those are quite, well, they're not as heavy as the rest. And they have more, well, flexibility, more friction. But one really, really stands out. And that's that weird color ball right over there. That's the bouncing ball. And I got one from them. It's the Super Ball. Oh, and this one stands out as well because the eight ball over here is a ball that um, will have different physics than all of the others because it doesn't suffer from the same gravity. You have to look at it from a top-down view, and that's where that means it's breaking the fourth wall between all of the others because all of the others will suffer from real gravity so if I put this elastic super ball over here that's really bouncy then that might 
help us get the eight ball of the screen, which is the mission. Bam! Alright, that was the first contraption. Let's see if we can finish the second. All you have to do is put the bowling ball inside of the incline, or whatever you call it, a column box. Nay. Boom. Yes, this is, well, I'm not sure if it's really one-on-one -on -one a remake, but yes, this game is The Incredible Machine 2. It has exactly the same parts, but everything looks shiny and new and like it's the year 2000, which it technically was. Gears and belts, how does that work? Shut up with the hints. Maybe we could find a way to turn off the hints. Is that it? Sure. Alright, conveyor belt, peep. Gear, and another gear. And yes, even most of the puzzles are the same. Alright, the road will run that way. This will rotate counterclockwise, clockwise, counterclockwise. That's what we want. Go. And now we have both basketballs in the pipe column. That dude along. Cheetah Totters! You gotta love those! Ga weg met die Bam! So if this pinball will fall on this side of the Cheetah Totter, which has a different appearance than the other one, but it's exactly the same, then it will flip! Flip! Nice! Make the balls go into the boxes by using a pulley. I... Alright, use a pulley. This... It's tutorial level number five, and if I am not mistaken, this is the first level that did not appear in The Incredible Machine 2 from 1994. Not 100% sure, but I do think this is the first one that stands out. So this is the tutorial that teaches you how pulleys work. So just connect everything that's being pointed at by the hints. So this will fall, this will go up, that means the pulley will pull this one down. And that will flip, flip everything the other way. And that's how you get balls into motion. Dat klonk weer beter in mijn hoofd. Start the four household appliances. Household appliances. So how do they work? This one's connected to an outlet that's always working. And this one is connected to an outlet that will work as soon as the switchy flip. Alright, let's turn all of them on. So one's a fan, one's a vacuum, the other one's a mixer, and the other is a can opener. It's a very luxurious can opener, though. I've never seen one in real life like that. That's because Burn toast. I got can openers that are not electric, and I know how to use them sometimes. So you got this Super Bowl. Let's put it there. It will go back up a flip. Flip. All right. That's nice. Um, sometimes I forget to read what I have to do on a puzzle, so... Then I will just guess what I have to do. That tennis ball was used to pull the, the, the bread inside the toes. And hey, Ruba, how are you doing? And hey, Jonas. Primo's... Bowling balls is Primo's here? The logs by all right, you gotta love this music. It's a live performance of the music from The Incredible Machine 2, which makes me want to take it a little bit slow because enjoy this. Hop. Isn't it lovely? CD audio. Start the blender and the. So for now, all that you need to do is copy what's on the left. But if you want, you can still switch the music to MIDI. And it sounds, it still sounds terrific! Oh, yeah. 
speedrunning. Where's the fun in that with this game? Hop on. I want you to turn on the lava lamp, the flashlight, and in the process, activate the solar panel. Let's do that. All right, easy peasy. Put the soccer ball over there. Connect this teeter totter to. Nice work, Tony. So this ball. This soccer ball will turn on the flashlight. Flashlight will uh, power the solar power outlet. Then the motor will start revolving the conveyor belt, the basketball will roll, will maybe even hit the lava lamp, and that will turn the lava lamp straight on. Alright. Not sure why it turns rainbow colored, but who cares? Hey AJ! Light Aladdin's lamps and the candle. Disney references. I do think this is another tutorial that was not in the original The Incredible Machine 2. So this one will slide easily down probably and will get lit by my magnifying glass. There we go. Fire, we invented fire. Hubba. And fire is contagious of course. Only on items that can be lit on fire. Light the match and make fire with the flint rocks. Ah, the flint rocks! Sounds like neighbors from the flint stones. Ah. Alright, if the ball, the bowling ball, will hit the teeter totter, it will pull out the pin over here, which will fling up the match and it will be lit because the side panel of the matchbox is right over here yeah, it's a bit a bit of a weird contraption this this small device but it's very cool there we go I just demonstrated that credo just demonstrated that blow up all of the dynamite <sighs> all right Right, progressive music. So if you put this in here, wait, there's no information on this. Oh, that's lame. I just switched off the info panels. I, I thought that would turn off the 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 help hints. Blow up all of the Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look. This is nitroglycerin. It will explode if it's bumped or dropped with enough force so if I put it over here it won't explode if I put it right there it will explosion so if I put one in here and I put one in here right mouse click clones the tool don't do that on the incredible machine one on the incredible machine one that will bring you back to the main menu don't get used to it so as you can see it has different reactions on different kinds of walls the beach wall will not be damaged just like the the, the the iron pipe or metal pipe let's call it metal there where the flowers sever from uh, the burn all right let's put this right here and put this in here and this in here and it will it, it can push and flip buttons and switches as well Bam. Cool. Learn how to use remote bombs and which is stronger, red or yellow brick. I never understood why some objects are in the background like magnifiers and some are in the foreground. Well, that's that's complex. Some of them are um, even snapped to a grid like uh, uh, I, I don't have any examples right now. There were others can be placed on every per pixel perfect. Yes. So this is a um, 
explosion device if you well I'll just demonstrate this like this if you hit that something will explode but it can be pulled down as well both of the walls explode by the way try to get your rocket into space before the other two rockets can stop it oh yeah oh hey the the chat number is stuck somehow let's see if we can fix that is it fixed? Fix, 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 fix. Go. What? What? All right, I messed it up. Never mind. Never mind. So, rockets galore. Put a rocket here. Put a ball there. And this rocket will light the others. Oh, wait. It's the other way around. It will not... It has to be shot through the top of the screen before the other ones block it. Launch all three fireworks. All right. But you have to place the fireworks. As you can see, there's a candle that will get lit. And the fun part about these fireworks, they all look the same, but you can program them to... Uh, look different so this one will be medium small and huge light them please still not that impressive I know launch and explode all three missiles notice how each type of wall is affected oh these will explode when they hit something All three of them will be lit like this. So the Roman wall will survive, the wooden will not, and this one, the danger wall, not even sure what it's called. Fire all the cannons! Okay. More of a showcase. Yeah, I can work for these people. This one. Weg met die hints. Nice. Put the bowling ball into the steel cage. Using an apple mouse, I hate those. Put the bowling ball inside of the steel cage. All right. If you don't know what to do, you can look at the hints or see what happens if you do nothing. The mouse will flip on the switch. What's the name of the mouse? Newton, baby. Look at that 3D pre-rendered sprites right there. I played this since I can remember anything. I played this a lot. Does it show? Does it show that I played this a lot? All right. Let's see if there's another way to make electricity. So this foot pump will make air, blow it this way, the pinwheel will rotate and the motor will start rotating as well through the conveyor belt and then the mixer will start electrifying. Hop on. It was very short though, but that's what happened. Alright, there are different shapes of balloons in this game and all of them need to survive. Except for the happy one. All right, let's see if we can find a way how to destroy every balloon with, uh, save every balloon because all of them will explode because this, uh, puppy, I always thought it was a deer, like that in Hedge, yeah, will get hit by the scissors and will explode and this one, Lumpy from the Happy Tree Friends will get exploded. So if I put this here, that will never happen. I put tie those together hop nothing happens but as you can see the happy one's a little bit trippy well it's a good thing we got a tech right here it's called a tech right it's a thumbtack spook op my new laptop what's nah new maar wel zonde boom there you go i think so dad 
pop all of the blimps. Well, the blimps are a bit <laughs> annoying. And it can light candles. Ruba, Sid and Al's <laughs> Incredible 2 machine. I finished that. Maybe after we done all the tutorials, maybe we could do a level or three on that game because I got it running right here. So this one will turn on the flint rocks fire, rotate and get hit by the boots. Take your time, take all the time you need. Hot air balloons. We go. They should launch all of them. Ha! Make each balloon go into a yellow brick box and each bowling ball into a red one. DJ Kamasaki. Zei ik nou laatst? Dat was echt vet grappig. DJ Lama? Nee, zoiets zei ik. Dat is echt heel grappig. All right, the anti-gravity pads that will reverse. Gravity, like bowling balls will go up and balloons will get pulled down. They will just behave exactly the other way around. Impressive graphics, uh, imp impressive physics for 1994. It was already in The Incredible Machine 2. Though, the return of The Incredible Machine contraptions featured them as well, of course. How much tutorials Put there were? bowling balls into a cage by making an apparatus sip. About 50. <laughs> All right, Jack in the box. Conveyor belt, or conveyor, or belt, they're just called belts. There we go. Scared the mouse. The mouse will start running and boing, boing, boing. Mom! Pinball wizard! Hop, oh, I don't like hints. So, what we need to do is uh, let the pinball not die on us for five seconds. <laughs> yeah, Get you're asking for it. But if you go back, by the way, which is going to be very interesting later on in the game, let's go back to that puzzle, Pinball Wizard. And when you um, finish the level, um, you can look at the original solution, and that that's that's quite good. <laughs> okay, show our solution. Ga weg met je vieze handjes. Even they don't get to use the flippity flip. Get both balloons off the screen. Yeah, there are so, quite some references to real life and other uh, stuff. Like uh, the animals are all called after scientists like Newton and uh, Curie. All right, what does this do? It's a boxing glove. Bump the button and the left side to make it punch things. It even makes a punching sound. Bam! It's fun. Turn Electric mixers and can openers. All right, you can place both of them on the right side of the level. So the left side of the puzzle will still remain obsolete and useless. Toasters! How do toasters work? Well, we already got a slight taste of toasters. Toasters of taste. Put them, connect them to a socket. How does that work, by the way? You just need to put them close to it. It will automatically find one to attach to if it's not too far away. So let's put this one here. And you need a ball or something falling. Can be a cat, a dog, whatever. There are no dogs in the game, don't worry. And um, that will put in the toast. And you can even configure, oh my god, that 3D render over here. That's good, because this is not used in the game at all, not even that angle. You can choose, if you press the computer, how you would like your toast. Would you like it plain white? 
little darkish burn or, or like a brown I like it like a brown and it will hit the eight ball because again the eight ball like a, a bowl billiards ball ball of billiards or whatever do not suffer from the same gravity they have to be observed top down for any put each bowling ball into a steel cage not a Nicholas cage but a steel cage well this is an accelerator how does it work it makes a lot of noise everything that goes through it will be shot out of it with well a rapid speed look at the shininess I remember by the way now if you look at the shininess where the lights coming from on these pipes you'll see they did an amazing job on this game even on the incredible machine 2 though I remember that when contraption maker from 2014 was well, I, I'm not sure if it was a Kickstarter but I got the game pre alpha or at least an alpha because I backed it or bought it at the time before it got released they well the light would come from the wrong angle when you rotate these pipes so I told that to one of the developers and they took that out or fixed it for that matter so I'm, I'm, I'm a proud man I'm a really really proud man dankjewel Laura wel trusten see you morgen all of the pinballs off the screen not a bit nerdy, no. <laughs> I'm nerdy a lot. <laughs> yes, you got these egg timers and you can program them. If you put the timer to the 12 o'clock, it will, will push out the ball as soon as it will get hit. And as you can see, this one will take three to four five seconds and this one as well and you need that because this one boom needs to explode before this one can get pushed out huh? turn on all of the computers to read the message oh man read the message what if I win what will they say ah okay now okay then have that up a right that's helder no Ha! Sink the 15 ball in the upper left corner pocket. All right, breaking the fourth wall here. As you can see, the the small ball besides the table will act differently from the others because they don't fall. They have a top-down view. Told it three times now. Gonna stop mentioning it. I'm gonna mention it a few more times. All right, there's Moiko. Put it right here. All right, it's up to you. Which color is the eight ball gonna be? You can name it. Let's see if I can click it faster. Hey, the hats are neat. Hey, Delta Ray Studios number three. And it's gonna be black, blue, just white. Oh, Credo, I like the way you think. It's supposed to be white. Or else it would be an illegal move where you got doubles. It doesn't work like that. Bam! Suck him! Blow the hot air balloon off the screen and start the jack in the box. Alright, listen to this. We got stuff to lit this. But there are other ways to blow off the uh, air balloon without even lighting it. Echt niet? Ja, echt wel. I'll show you. Just hit the rocks, like start a fire. As you can see, the left one is a bit finicky. There we go. Then put the coffee pot or teapot, whatever it is. I call it a coffee pot, but it's a tea boiler. Nee, it zit me niet. Ik weet wat een baseball is. Laat me met rust. It's a coffee pot. Let's get that out of the world. But what do we need this for? Oh, we can scare the mice. The mice, the mice. The mouse. Hey, Alexi. There we go. Good evening, man. Lovely of you to join in. 
Lasers emit intense beams of colored light. Turn on all of the lasers. Turn on all of the lasers. All right, this is where the game gets complex. As it, it just needs a, uh, a socket. So this will do two green ones, two red ones, and two blue ones. There we go. Although the blue one, blue ones won't do anything because we still need to flip, 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 flip. flip. Yappa, there we go. Lovely. -y. Laser activated plugs. All right, it's time for some precision. This never works the first time. Although I do remember that last time it did. You have to point the laser of the right color inside of that little, little, well, activation hole. Like this. Before that, the outlet will not work. So if I do this, connect this to this, it will not work. <laughs> it's Timothy for mist. Yay! So we have to set this one to green and put it right about here. And then the blue one there. Alright, is. I think. Uh, where did the take her? What do you guys think? Is this gonna work the very first time I try? Or not? It's a bit of a. And if it goes wrong, which one am I missing? Am I gonna miss the green one or the blue one? <laughs> the blue is too high. Yeah, I think you're right. But now I think you're not right. Alright, there we go. In three, two, one. I got it! First time! And I'm enjoying this very, very new age kind of space music. Hi. The goal is to open all of the cans. I didn't miss any of them. Mix colored laser lights in order to start. Ooh, mixes. Weg met die hints. Put that one right there. And if you're joining this live stream right now, then get your agendas, get your calendars. Next week, same time, I'll be live streaming. Rayman Legends. Hop! <laughs> Making it easy for myself. Hop! Because you have to mix colors. As you can see, well, let's replay solution. Red and blue make purple. Green and red make yellow. And uh, this makes some sort of. Yeah. Something in between blue and green. <laughs> Max, we can't just blow up on Yeah? Turquoise. Turquoise. Yeah, that's what I Turquoise. Learn how to Turquoise. make laser beams change direction with mirrors. You will see how red and green doesn't make yellow with the laser mirrors. Yeah, ja, echt wel. Wel in dit spel. Is Rayman Legends the one with the musical numbers? Yes. Hell yeah. <laughs> Maybe I can get Moxie mad enough to join me on the musical numbers. <laughs> oh, Black Daddy! <laughs> flicky, flicky, flicky! So you got mirrors. Those are gonna make it even more. Even more, I said it again. Even more complex. It's an angled mirror, always on mm, 45 degrees. This must have been designed by a colorblind person or a person that had to work with a limited color palette. Think about it. The game's like this since The Incredible Machine Zwei. Flip! Bam! And all colors together, Max? Rood, blauw and uh, rood? Nee, rood, blauw and blauw. Nou, rood, blauw, groen. 
Bruin? Nee, wit. Ja, het is lasers, het is not paint. Oké, dan is het wit. Ja, dan is het wit. Ja. Ja, is goed dat je dit, dit had ik context. Sorry. Maxi said, brown, mixing the mist brown. And I'm like, no, it's white. Oh, wait. She thought we were talking paint and not light. My bad. All right, enough of those tutorials. We can... Are we gonna hit it? Yes, we're gonna hit it. There we go. Oh, shit. This one was missing. It's a laser detector. It only blinks green. If it detects laser, it will blink or... Well, not even sure. Blink. It, it will be red. Wait. Does it do anything if it's not hit? No. That means the red... The red bulb will never... Oh, this one cannot be lit, the red one. Only in the tutorial. Alright, that's sucky. Hey, Jesper. Fietspot. Put the pinballs into the aquariums. Ja, ja, pinballs, aquariums. Gaat goed samen. Gaat niet stuk. Kunnen we doen. YOLO. Alright. There we go. Flip, 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 flip. Flip, flip, flip. Hop. Easy peasy. Next one. Buckets. Hey, we did this one on the incredible machine too. Just earlier. Make it heavy. Oh, this is the heavy side. On the incredible machine, it's the other way around. This is heavy, this is not heavy. Heavy. So this one will suck to the bottom very quick. Hoppa! Next! Alright, the same puzzle. Snips and trimmers. Trimmers will snip. Oh, this is a snipper. A tin snipper will snip tin. And the tin snippers will snip rope as well. And rope cutters will cut rope. Put all five cats between the pipes. How did I do this? Like this? Alright, Bob. Show me your fish face. Ah, uh, Bill! I called him Bob again. His name is Fish. Bill the fish. A curse word every now and then is not prohibited, Arthur Finn. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. Alex, we can handle it. We're all grown ups here. Papa! And all the cats are called Curry! Alright. How does cheese work with mice? The mouse will run to the cheese, the mouse will run from the cat. But which one does it prefer? <laughs> Dying or food? Do it like this so everybody can have a cheese. <laughs> hey Attila Rex! Thanks man! Get a mouse into each mouse hole. Alright, we're almost at the end of the tutorial. So that's weird. It will <laughs> flip. <laughs> it will go for the cheese, even if that means death. I'm not here for kids, Ultrafin. I'm not here for kids. And a curse word every now and then. If you're offended by curse words, then the problem lies closer to you than to me, I guess. Fuck. <laughs> Put a bowling ball inside each crate by constructing a similar contraption to the one set up on the left. Hey, Rock Dad. All right, you got the mandrill, the baboonial. If you can hit the baboon. All right, I'll just explain how this works. The baboon is on a treadmill. Treadmill on a conveyor belt. But it, it it needs to be powered, and it's gonna get powered when the mandrill starts, well, the baboon, I'm gonna call it, but fuck it, a mandrill. If he starts to run, then the conveyor belt beneath it will run, or above it, just left one beneath it, right one above it. Though, don't forget, 
you have to figure out a way how to get the baboon Manro to run to 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 move because right now it will only move when it sees banana so if you hang something heavy like this laundry basket beneath it connected to that it will get visual of the bananas if it doesn't see the bananas it won't run but if you hit it on the head this happens it will stop running for just a second or two but that's not part of this level that's just extra there we go all right that was good get one Fleming into each house Observe the upper two levels, then complete the lower two. Alright. This is fun. This guy is called Mel Schlemming. And you can fuck him over anytime you like. Mel Schlemming, clearly not based on a lemming, is a dumb kid who starts walking or running the direction you point him to. Or stand still. He can do three things. Stand still, watch how what time it is, run, and walk. So... We'll have this Mel walk towards his home, and this one, we can let him, well, we can even have him fall inside of his house. Schlemming! There we go. Bam! Nice! Put the pinball into the aquarium. Alright, next animal you get to see is, um... Edison! This guy's Edison. Edison Alligator. Listen to this. That sound that he makes, I always thought that he would laugh. Because he does that lisp after he eats someone. So look at this, he's gonna eat, eat, eat Mel. Come on Mel, get eaten. See? That's laughter, right? And as you can see, this ball will roll down a little bit slow. That's because, and I know, they kind of fuck with gravity on this level. And no, you cannot change the atmospherics. And yes, that's a thing. Air pressure and gravity can differ between puzzles. Hey, where did the background go? Yeah, he laughs in Tim 2 and he laughs here as well, but the alligator... It makes the same sound. Vacuum up both mice. Mark yourself alive. You can even change the background color, but that's permitted. So if I put this here, oh shit, put it here, it will the cheese will flip on the vacuum. And there we go. I never like it when the vacuum sucks up the cheese as well, but let's see what happens. Now let's see if we can find a way that it will vacuum the cheese too. No, it doesn't. It's not gonna skip that way. All right. All right. Tutorial number fifty. Programmable balls. This is another tutorial they left out of the Incredible Machine, because if you look at this, these can these are programmable balls. You can set them to marbles, but that's only vanity. That's just a skin. You can set them to all colors just to make it easier in the object. Uh, the object, uh, the the objective to uh, uh, name them. Like I want the blue ball there, the red ball there, or the marble over here. But you can change all their stuff. Like I want it to be really dense, and I want it to have some mass, but no friction at all. Then this will happen. So if I put one here. And I give this one a lot of elasticity and friction, but not much density. I think it will act like, oh my god, it will even float up with normal gravity. That's weird. Alright, let's give it a little bit of mass. What happened here? Start the Maybe the gravity is upside down? Or I fucked up my ball. I know the number of uh, views is not visible because it was not working. And I don't know why, and then I it slow. Phew! Sierra!
Haha, <laughs> that was good. I'm trying to find a way to make this one bounce. Oh, that's better. Now give it a little bit more of this. Wait, almost there. Less mass. Damn it, if I missed, it's not if I missed. You mean the punch sound? What do we get now? Why does the ball not making it heavier? Your lower abdomen circle is ready to rock. Yeah. Sure. Hop, make it float. Good work. You just solved all the tutorial contraptions. Are you ready for the next batch of brain teasers? I think so. Good luck. All right, let's take a quick break from this game to show you this one. Put the pinball into Right. There we go. Are you ready? I'm going to show you something cool, but really cool. Somebody was mentioning this. Phew. Yeah. yeah. We've got a hostile cat and mouse situation on 5th and L. Unauthorized cartoon altercation in progress. Proceed with caution. Now you have a vibe. Sit it and you die. In the nick of time. The house of mine. And up to perfect line. Wrong, Timothy. This is Windows 3.1. And get up easily. Now up it goes. For years of the rebel. You realize, Sydney, I'm going to have to eradicate you. Gee, Al, do you really gotta? Yes, Sydney. I'm afraid so. And that's what the game is about. Same sound effects, though. This is. I think this game has been made in between The Incredible Machine. Maybe even between one and two. This is the kitty variant of the game. And I finished this game, there's even a way to get extra secret harder puzzles. And every puzzle that you solve will add a puzzle piece to this. And then you can unlock the secret password. Honestly, I don't even remember what it is. But I do know I got videos on every freaking puzzle on this game because I did finish it. And it's really fun. Look at this! Cutscene! Hey, gang! Welcome to me and Al's big screen debut! Oh joy, oh glee, oh genuine heartfelt elation. Now all you've got to do to solve the puzzle is smack the bottom of all the message machines to open the curtains. And this is the exact same as the Incredible Machine, although all parts work differently somehow. And it's really fast paced and it's good! But look how funny shit is, like extending the width of a tile is the harmonica, uh, making it wider is the, is the, on the other side is a caterpillar, <laughs> flush it, well you know what that means, you can even, 
about about face. This is the about face. It goes left, right, left, right, left, right. It just rotates it. <laughs> Action. Sit and L. And sit is the mouse. And L is quite civilized. Somehow. And they're like Tom and Jerry. Oh, look. Eunice elephant in her natural habitat. My paws are numb with excitement. Feed Eunice and her sister each a peanut, if you would. All right, listen to this. Every cutscene at the start of a level is the same. They got like, they made maybe 10, 20 of them. The only thing that's custom animated are the mouths and the, the, the audio. Because that uh, cutscene of uh, Al eating the, the, the large sandwich is uh, returning, reoccurring all the time, but with different audio. So that's really smart what they did. If I restart this level, let's see if I can restart this level. Nuke a tune! How high do you want to nuke it? I just want to fucking nuke it. Return to the main menu, solve a puzzle. See, different animation, but same text. Oh, look. Eunice elephant in see? a natural habitat. My paws are numb with excitement. Feed Eunice and her sister each a peanut, if you would. Je hebt te watch out with this music. Anders, serieus, krijg je André Rieu achter je aan en dan moet ik straks betalen. Dus ik stop er alweer mee. Bye bye. It's a very good game. If you got some spare time, then do check that out. But now, let's continue with. Itchy, scratchy, Tom, Jerry, potato, potato, Curry and Newton, Sid and Al. This music is rechtervrij. Well, you say that, but I had some issues on my long play of that game. Alright, let's continue with the easy puzzles. Number one, rocket pool. Alright, you get less hints now. Later in the game, you get no hints at all. Hop! And now it gets more fun because now I have to explain less and less. There we go. Hop! Help Mel get home. How do we get Mel home? Alright. There's. A slight error in how quickly he goes through the pipe. Look at this. Count with me. If he goes in, we'll start counting. One, two, three, four. Oh, damn it. Wait. Damn it. Until he reaches the bubbles at the end. There we go. In. One, two, three, four, five seconds. To get from here to there. But if we do it like this. Look at this. Start counting when he ends the pipe. One. Two. What? Mel, what the fuck? Fuck Mel. Hoppa. So Mel gets sped up by the, the length of a tube. That's... What? I don't get that. Get Newton... All right, this one's a little bit finicky. Let the mouse sit on this. If it will, oh, it doesn't fit, damn it. Then I'll put it here. Make this uh, part a sex explode. Poochies there. Poochies here. Hide the hints. Poochies right over there. And put another cheese over here. There we go. Come on, adventure time. Good mouse. This cheese needs to... Okay, there we go. Bam! Hop! Hop! Ja, dat dacht jij. Put it on the edge even more. And you have to do this carefully. It might slide off. Ja, zie je? Slap geloten. Kom op! Leg die kaas op die rand. Hey, 
Hey Jane, Xemilixa. Xemilixa, I hope I pronounced that right. Lovely that you're joining us tonight. Come on, we can do this! It's weird because this is the toughest one. Welcome to our lovely community where we play MS DOS games on the Monday night. Though this is not MS DOS, I know, I know, I know. Shortcut! We found a shortcut, look at this! I know, Alexi! Don't worry, I'll, I'll be playing Amazon's games real soon. I have to get this out of my system. Kom op met die kaas, jongen. Hang op die rand. Hangen. This should be it. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna approach this a different way. <laughs> Look at this. It's good. Hoi! That's how it goes. If you just miss this, I'll replay my solution. Hop, that's how we roll! Alright, show the official solution! Oh! <laughs> I always do it the other way! Ah! It all falls into place! Light the candle. That is it for intelligent people as well, but a little bit dumber. Hop, 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 hop. How do we light that candle? I love the anti gravity pad over there. Great usage. All right, let's flip the switch. Attach the laser to the switch. Doesn't flip. Flip. Um, oh, wait. Let's do it the other way around. I'm gonna make a mess right now. So we light the hot air balloon so it will be filled with hot air, and then we have a lit match. Thinking or drinking? Drinking juice. Drinking. <laughs> ba -ba. Lit, 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 lit. Uh, thanks to Quidditch, Mama Sign and Flo, but long need. Put the basketball into the basket. Waarom doet hij het niet? Huh? Zou hij het nu wel doen? Hop. Nee. Microsoft Pinball Arcade? No man. What about 3D Ultra Pinball? This? This is fun. Let's see if we can do this with one part. Oh! Hey! Nay, the other way. Do it! Do it! <gasps> Nate, he dealt! Yeah, I dealt! Yes! Yes! Ah, I want to see that again! Replay solution! <laughs> Alright, show the official solution, please! 
Why would I play on an Amiga emulator? I got a real Amiga laying upstairs. Hola! Who cares this for a guy? Doesn't reach. Doesn't fit. You know why this doesn't fit? Well, it clearly does fit. That's because on the incredible machine, those would be higher in shape. And that's why it doesn't fit, because it still has that same mask, I guess, but... Not sure why they slimmed them down. Um, yeah. Dun 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 dun. Let's see, what am I forgetting about? Yeah, from now on, they're gonna give you some puzzle pieces that you probably do not need. Flip! Da 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 da! Oh. Because it's really tough to. Record from that device, though I could try someday. I think I got the well, not the 1200, maybe the 800. Toast the bread, toast the bread. All right, I know how to do that. Flip nice when we need solar power. Like this! Uh, 600, sorry. Uh, eh. I'm a disaster when it comes to Amiga because I barely played on it. Fire the cannon. Fire the cannon. Well, this is an easy one. I remember. Hop! There we go. Boing. Flip. Shoot. And boom! Why is he laughing? I want to hear that again. <laughs> Break Bill's aquarium. Sadist. All right, you got like all kinds of ways to do this, but the easiest one. I remember that I really had issues back in the day on this puzzle, boing, and then let it float up. Um, instead of having the ball go all the way around. I'll just simply do this because I'm an asshole. <laughs> I love it when a plan comes together. Do it again. All right, the original solution. Oh my God, that's so complex. Um. What, why? Why the punching glove? The ball would have nailed it as well. Turn the fan on. All right. Who's my biggest fan? Hmm. Slithery incredible. Okay. Yeah, you been with it, you Timothy. Kom elke week wel weer met iets wat me verrast. Vind mooi. Alright, connect this to this. What am I doing? Um, right, this will hit that ball, the ball will fall, and it will hit the gas pump. Ah, it goes the other way around. There we go. These are tiny gears. Oh, they're called tiny gears. That's funny. Didn't know that. Was just a lucky guess. Yeah. Connect all of them to the mouse. Ah, can't reach too far away, freaking mouse. 
So if you just join in, next week we're gonna play. Uh, um. Raymond Legends. So set up for fast. I think this should do it. Oh wait. There we go. This is a more complex one, as you can see. They get tougher along the way. But don't, not to worry. It, it reminds me of Red Alert 2, this music track. Maybe Commander Kong, I mean, uh, ah, both of the balloons. Clearly based on the Twin Towers. Oh, this is an easy one. This is easy. You can put a tack, a thump tack inside of the same cage put the anti-gravity pad below it and pop. put all the blimps in the all right listen to this all the blimps should be on the right side of the screen but the other ones will go out we can do this two ways the original way or the part way Why the pinball thing in the Sierra game? That's because they always had a thing for pinball stuff. Oh, nay! So that's not happening. Alright, the original way. The original way. Oh, ho, ho. Credo, good night, man. Don't forget, by the way, next Friday, Moxie and I are gonna continue on a little nightmares too. Have you guys seen the Monday, uh, the, the 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 live stream last Friday? It was so intense. Moxie even had some nightmares after that, right? Off the bottom of the That's easy. She can defend right now. Krijg zo gewoon een dienblad naar mijn hoofd of zo. I'm not why, but in, I'm not sure why, but in this version of the game, the background elements sometimes look a little bit flat, without contrast. I don't, I'm not sure. All right, let's use the pipa, the pipa power. Um, papi poop. Uh, okay. I think this is it, but I'm not sure. Oh, that's it! Yes! Pop the silver balloon. But don't worry, we're gonna continue on Little Nightmares last Friday because Maxi and I enjoyed it a lot. I was looking back my last stream on this puzzle, by the way, on The Incredible Machine 2, which features most of the same puzzles. This one only has some more. And this one's a bitch. Oi, if it hits the scissors, we're gonna make it. Come on, hit the scissors. Up. But now the bucket's gonna be in the way. Yes, that always happens. It's clearly the same engine as on the uh, the Incredible Machine 2. Maybe now we can trap the bucket to do it for us. Oh, ah, yeah, okay. Helemaal goed. Do it again. Thanks, Dad. We hit the, the lower arm of the... This is the original solution. Duly note that all of those fish tanks are there to claim space. That you cannot use it. Put the baseball in the aquarium and the pinball in the cage. All right, I'll show you. If a ball rolls over this and it's heavy enough, it will fall through. If it's not, it won't. Easy enough, right? Uh... 
put the spring there. It's a spring, right? It's a springboard. Same stuff that Jazz Jackrabbit uses, but one made of wood and spring. It won't fit, I know. Ah. Perfect! Perfect! Launch the two rockets off the top of the screen. Top mark itself a lot. Alright, this is another one that's kinda new to me because this puzzle is not in the Incredible Machine 2. Red and green, red and green. Wait, ah, okay. As you can see, the green one gets stuck here. Maybe they'd like to be mixed up a little bit. Maybe together they'll make something that looks like yellow. It's always a little bit finicky working with the lasers in this game, but maybe this will do it. Am I warming your heart tonight, Alexi? That's what I'm here for tonight. I I think they both need to go the other way, but Oh, that's good. Oh, the other one's not attached to the outlet. Come on. <laughs> Lift off. Shoot up all the fireworks. Yeah. Look at the Newton mouse sitting there doing nothing. And where's the contrast in the background? Just don't get it. Why it's gone on this game. Man, I... Back in the day, it took me a lot of time to figure out how this puzzle works. And then I figured out that you can do this. All right, that's five of them. Now the last one. Ah, man, we need also an eikel mel. Try it again. Background <laughs> contrast DLC. Oh, what? What are you gonna tell me? Are you gonna tell me later? You're gonna tell me there are even more puzzles for this game? I don't believe you. Put the ball into the box. Downloadable content is what I really, really want. Uh, I don't know. The blue one in the crate. DLC, huh? The DLC, huh? In the basket. And what a DLC, one in the huh? Box. <laughs> you should see this. <laughs> Alright, this one's always a little bit messing around. <laughs> uh, Mocking Beach? Hmm? <laughs> in the la. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm using the unused drawer. There's no salad. <laughs> yes, this music again. Oh, it's the chiller room, right? Oh, from dar. Nah, I'm not even out. Yeah, it's good. She had a sin in it, the mother. Come on, we only got the green and the red one. Freaking marbles. Really? I never. Honestly, you're gonna tell me this is the official solution? Oh. But Sai! But Sai! Alterfin and Timothy for Biss say hi. Maxi says the hi baseballs back. Balls in the boxes. Put the balls inside of the boxes. Balls. 
Nothing happens. And DJ Kama. Maxi says hi Kama. Good morning. All right, let's place those keys on the spot. Zijn ze op? Nee. This one goes counterclockwise, so that one goes clockwise, 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 counterclockwise. This one goes counterclockwise. That means this one goes counterclockwise. This one has to go clockwise. That means this one goes counterclockwise, counterclockwise. And this one goes clockwise. Nee, dat klopt niet. Wat? Voor mij gaat die bovenste de verkeerde kant op. Oh shit, I didn't know what the bloom was for. Alright, as an excuse, make it smile. Hey, <laughs> this one's stuck. There we go. Timothy, slap lekker. Good night. We all love you as a friend. Put the soccer ball into the basket. Like our, our, our best friend. Thanks for the beer, Equitix. Jane. Maybe you could pitch your ID over at the Discord channel. At least join it. A lot of people in the Discord are a fan of retro gaming, MS-DOS gaming, old shit like we're playing tonight it's a growing community and I think you might want to be part of that community and if not it's okay it's free and it's fun everybody's welcome there this will do it don't miss it Hoppa. and the soccer balls in the basket Easy puzzle 21. Put the scissors here. A little bit to the right. All right, how do we catch the mouse? Maybe like this. I don't know. Um, this is a tough one. It's all about timing on this one. This is it. Good night, Jane. Thanks for joining. And don't forget, next Monday. Open the can of tomato soup. Live streams every Monday. <gasps> this is a new puzzle. Honestly, this one doesn't even ring a bell to me. What does the hint say? If the baseball was somehow held in place, the explosion would be enough to bump it into the... Ah, that's a good hint! Oh. Oh. 
it, it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so pretty. All right, to open the can of tomato soup, we need to power on the outlet on the top right. That means the green laser needs to enter it. And we need the red and green to make yellow, believe it or not. Ah, we're missing one mirror. Oh, we got it! Nice! Ooh, same music. Alright, this one's easy. Take it down, take it down, take it down. There we go. Oh shit, forgot about one thing. I love this music. Lure, Kitty in a cage. Cat into the cage. Click. <laughs> Nothing happens. This is what we want. Look, the 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 rope of the extension cord, the the power outlet cord is very long because it has to be near the machine, the motor, not the outlet itself. Another weird feature of the incredible machine. Get used to it. If you don't like it, don't buy it. Flip! This is gonna pull, 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 Rotate. Oh, we need more rotation devices. No, this mouse is another mouse. This one is way dumber. Curie Cat, get to the canned food. It's Curie and Newton. So we need a rope, that's for sure. Hmm. We made fire. But you can skip all of this. You can just do this, I guess. Huh. Ah, it's the same. Uh, but we're lacking the ball right now. You can skip all of that. Look. That's it! Oh shit, we need to get Curry up there. <laughs> Anti gravity pat! Yeah! Hello, Pilch here. That's how you skip half of a puzzle. Open the can, start the mixer, and heat up some coffee. Fire the laser. Fire the laser. Fire the laser. It's limbo time! Man, I remember playing this a lot at my mom's place on my room on my 486 the year 2002-2003-2004 but then I played The Incredible Machine 2 not this one my computer couldn't take this one <laughs> Yeah, I think this is it. All that's missing is this. Help. Night in the mountains. Oh man, this one. I like this one. They really 
Use the background scenery to the maximum on this one. Though I have to say that for a 2000 game, they could have done better. Contrast. <laughs> How are you doing, Alexi? I found this mod for uh, Doom, modded version of Doom, freezing while I honestly all day have been cool until right now, tonight. So that's the both of us. But uh, I found this Doom mod, man you're surely gonna love that. Got no clue what I'm doing. Huh? Like always. Not even sure why I tied them together, but blow up both blimps. Blow up both of the blimps. That means we need to explode that thing over there. I always backwards engineer this shit whenever I can. Not sure what that fire is intended to do, but I do have a feeling right now. This is another puzzle that's not in The Incredible Machine 2, so that's why it sometimes is a bit new to me. Yes! I gotta do more. That looks really great, but they're not gonna finish Whoa. it. It's from 2019, found it online, and it looks like the original Doom with amazing graphics, though I think Bethesda doesn't like them to finish the, the mod, so... Bitches. Alright, roll this one down. Extend the ramp. The balloon figure. You mean the the dog? Oh, yeah. He looks like the mouse from Sid and Al. He looks like Sid. Let's investigate on that. We gaan zo even wat research doen. God verdikken me. Critics. I thought he looked like Lumpy from Happy Tree Friends. <laughs> maar oké. Okay. I think this is it. Let's see when we get the next balloon. Make the soccer ball float off the top of the screen. All right, reverse gravity. Look at this. Oh, not reverse, but yes, another one that I really had issues with back in the day. Yet it's easy. It's a bike pump, not a foot pump. Ik wil nooit mijn fiets opgeblazen met zo'n ding. Meer een luchtbed. Sorry for the Chinese. Ni hao. Is Japans. Weet ik veel. This is easy. 
This is so easy. But to the other side, please. Bitte. Danke. Come on, use the force. Ah, oh, god damn it. You're not using the force. What? Hey, Coolio. How are you doing, Cleo? Jeez, I haven't thought about Happy Tree Friends for so long. Do -do 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 -do. Blow Mel off the screen. I know this is easy, but I I'm talking about when I was adolescent. This would have been a great spot for the jet, by the way. Alright, let's put a rocket right here, because that seems to be the plan. Put this here. Oh, we're backwards engineering this. Well, I I really I still have them on DVD. Hey, why not check them out together someday on a live stream? Watching all Happy Three Friends episodes. I'm not sure if that's allowed, but I'd love to do that. Oh, I spoof it on my laptop. Bah. Yeah. I feel to do for it. Let's see what the bumper does, by the way. Ah! <laughs> this should do it. <laughs> Mel gets impatient, by the way. I don't know, but I'd love to watch that together with you guys. All of them, like, from start to the end. How cool would that be? Man, I remember downloading those as flash files. Um, I'm not sure, but I do think those screens say Newton with an exclamation mark. No, no, no. In this puzzle they put all kinds of stuff in so you cannot put stuff on some spaces. Gravity, that's it. Three ball, go around again. Alright, let's make Yuri Cat her life a living hell. Goes on forever. This is how I used to do it. <laughs> it works. <laughs> Cannot be the solution. This is the original solution. Ah, lame. How do you expect me to know to put the... Oh, maybe... No, it's not a hint. They used the pool cue down there to... <laughs> Poor cat. Help Newton Mouse. To get home. Well, he's far from home if he's doing that. Let's see if we can <laughs> cheat this one. Hop. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> That's it. Look, this is it. God damn it, Newton. Oh. I want to see that again. <laughs> Original solution. There we go. Sigh, dude, long. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> cat maneuvers. Put Curry the cat in the grass corner. Ooh, she's on a timer. Hmm. Hoe gaan we dat doen? This is another puzzle that's not in The Incredible Machine 2, so I really have no cue. clue. Clue. That was the first puzzle circle. Oh, she's gonna cause this herself. This over here. There is Ganon Skoman arm, gotcha. Aye. That's not happening. That's not happening like that. Yeah. Maybe give it a harder push. Like that's gonna make any difference. Huh? Can't you... Can't you fall? Come on, you can do this. Bleep. Oh, this didn't happen. This didn't happen again. He has to remain a little bit longer. Pushy, pushy, push. Yeah. The mouse gets scared. What are the hints? This mouse needs a bump in the right direction. Boom. Using the force of the pinball, I bet you could catapult Curie Cat. The pinball? Yeah. A cat is. Ah. Ah, the tail does it. Uh, that, that, that makes the difference, I guess. Hey, Dr. O'Hearn. Good evening, man. Oh. All right, feeding Curie. I know this one. This one's easy. Sierra game, same as your shout out. Hubba! We didn't even need a tita tata tata tita. Blow up the fish tank with the missile. Oh, I like puzzles like these. I like puzzles like these.
So this goes down there. Scare the mouse. Yeah, I've been messing around with this one quite a bit. The, the, the shoutouts are for the members only. I don't want to be an asshole, but... Hmm, we're onto something. Wait. Too lazy to make it for everyone. I made 25 of them. How about that? <laughs> oh, doesn't count because you need to fire the missile. <laughs> oh, this is... This is like the best, right? Damn it! <laughs> All right, clear. Start over. I won't erase anything. No worries. It's okay, Doctor Owen. Then I'll play you a shout out on Friday, man. And if you're checking out the stream and you want your own custom made animated shout out like this Then let me know. Ik weet niet of ze het doen. Doen ze het? Ze doen het niet. They're not working. It's weird. That's because of the game somehow. Geeft niks, geeft niks, ik weet niks, geeft echt niks. Good night, Dr. Owen. Sleep tight. Wat is dit nou? This is it? Yeah, that's it. That was easy. complex oh man the gear on the left side of the screen wasn't even wasn't Both even used mandrill hey Cody welcome good evening man how you doing all right so the bowling ball is falling next to Marv from uh, from Home Alone. <laughs> that comes then weer in me op, hè? I always thought that was Mar from Home Alone. So what? <laughs> All right. If this gets pulled, the mandrel will start running. But why? We have to bonk him on the head. Ah, let's do it some other way. This piano music, or silly phone, whatever it is. Bam! Meem! That's how you win. Mm. I remember this being a tough one. This level, on the original The Incredible Machine, had a different level. Different music. There we go. This music is in this level. I ensure you that. By the way, if it all goes too fast for you, then let me know. There's a full playthrough on this game on my YouTube channel already. I recorded that years ago.
Right now, find a way to light this match. That's it. Who krijg je het voor elkaar? There we go. Ah, damn it! Now the balloon is stuck. Put it right there. Ik heb nog nooit zoveel problemen gehad met de level. Wat is er aan de gaande? Na na na. Na na na. Na na na. Na na na. Oh damn it! Sit the balloon! Now, you tell me, is it Sid from Sid and Al? He had a different color, didn't he? Ja, je gaat er niet zo met een aansteker zitten, clown. A poodle. Oh, the other one, the purple one. More like a deer. The original solution. This is the original solution. Well, maybe the spacing of the gravity pads is a little bit off, but the rest of it, same solution. Turn the, on the Merry Mixer! Alright. Time for some fun. I know the original way to solve this one. Hide the hints. Hide the clue and hide the hints, please. Bitte, danke schön. This is it. Resolution beta, danke schön. Jawohl. Hoppa. Damn. Make the mouse motor run. He's not afraid of light. This is another puzzle that was not in The Incredible Machine 2. Ding, 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 ding. There we go. Easy peasy. Turn on all three mixers and blow up the TNT. I want to see that comparison. Where is it? <laughs> I need to see that. Photos and selfies. Oh, that's somebody else. That's Bass Lapper on the ice. <laughs> Game talk. Yes! Yes! That's it! All of these years I didn't know, but you used the balloon from The Incredible Machine too. Fuck this! <laughs> It all comes together now. It's freaking Sid reference Easter egg cash. A critics, thank you well. This sort of shit, it verrijkt my life. Click. What do we need to do? I'm not even reading. Blow up the TNT. Okay. <laughs> oh man. Really. It is freaking sit. If you want to see, it's on the Discord. Wat goed, man. Echt waar. Serieus. Echt heel goed. En dit is toch hoe, hoe mooie dingen geboren worden. Wat is dit nou, joh? Hop. Wait a minute. This one should be positioned right here. Oh, 
I haven't played Microsoft Flight Simulator, the new one, no. I've never been that much of a fan of Flight Simulator. It scares the mouse, that's good. God damn it. This was a complex one, honestly, but there we go. Mixer Rooney. Congratulations! <gasps> you just finished off the last of the easy contraptions. There's plenty more waiting for you, so go for it! Yes! Alright, from now on, the game's getting tough. That means. No more hints I was gonna say, but there are still hints. <laughs> Bam! We got power right here. I don't even remember this puzzle from the original The Incredible Machine 2. Music starts over, how lovely. That means we took a long time for the last puzzle. Send it to space, come on, let's send it! Got it. to his backcountry cabin. This one was tough because of all of the balloons. I don't have to explain anymore. Right now it's just puzzling. <laughs> I said. <laughs> I never knew this was Sid. Come on, Jeff fucking tunnel. Didn't see that coming. Geen idee waarom ik die pomp daar zet, maar ik vind het mooi. <laughs> he gets eaten even faster. Alexi, if it was up to you, what would I be playing in two weeks on the Monday night? If it was up to you, I'd love to know. Yeah. Make it a silver balloon. Damn it, Curry! You need to move out of the way. Oh, she ate it. Something truly retro, but like what? No, you can pick the game in two weeks. Oh shit! I think I know what you're gonna say, and I'm gonna write it down. I'm gonna write it down to be sure. To know. That's what you're gonna say. I wrote it down. Make all five jack in the boxes pop open. Pop open. This one's easy. Just find space to add new ones to it. And where to start? Mm.
There we go. This should do it. I remember on The Incredible Machine 2, on my original computer, my game would lag on this level because all of the uh, revolving uh, gears. Zork. I do own, like, a great deal of Zork games originally. Sounds like the perfect game for the Netherlands' slowest reader. Bonk Pavlov well, on the head. you always say that I'm the slowest reader on earth, or the Dutch slowest reader ever. But somehow, I guess you don't mind. It comforts you. It's freeware. Oh, that Zorg! Wait, I got those on a disc. That's not freeware, right? Well, I thought you were gonna say something else. Something more like... I don't know. Something like Crystal Caves. That's it so deep in my... Elegant new car. Alright. Equitix, what did I text to you? What did I I send a text to Equitix? So pa, you gaat hem raken. Uh I'm not sure if this is gonna work, but Ah they expect me to put this right here. Well sure. That's what I sent on a text to Aquitix. <laughs> Earthworm Jim? Get the balloon off the top of the screen without popping any blimps. This was a tough one back in the day, so you put this right here. Yeah, it, it seems like it's a joke that I remember of these puzzles, but it took me minutes to solve these. They're where I'm older now, and I... I don't have the sense to figure them all out, how to do them, no. I just fucking remember them from trial and error when I was a kid. Original solution, it's the same. Jenkins mum say hi to Jenkins and good night man. Thanks for joining. Uh, good night lady. Little do I know. Alright. Who's who's crazy about Piper? Huh? Hey, hell for Piper. A lot of pipes. Like Mario, yeah. There we go, this is the solution. Yeah, on the festival, well, yeah. Have you lag? If you're experiencing a lag, then reboot your computer. This instant. Papa! Let's see. It's not coming from my end. Get both balloons off the top of the screen without breaking them. Has anybody seen my dog? Yeah, you don't have 
this thing look this thing needs a rope to pull it to do it like this um, but if a ball hits it from the left side it does the same not sure why it keeps on doing it but all right let's fist fuck that pussy sorry context Context! Als je het zou zien, zou je het begrijpen! Let's fist fuck that pussy. Yeah. Nice. Alright. Spijt me. Nice! Works. Alright, I was a little bit out of line there. I admit that. But it's based on facts. Ja, andersom, uh, Japi. And the chat goes a little bit silent. I get that. My sincere apologies for that moment. They need to go out of the top of the screen without breaking them. But the... Ah. Yes! Come on, Rocket! Come on, where's Marty? Actually, launch the missile. Launch the missile. Let's see if we can find a way to do so. I remember that I did it like this. Um. But then, uh. Misschien vindt hij ons niet meer leuk. Bye, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Why go through all of the trouble for all this? I mean, out of pipes. Mm, almost, almost. Maybe this will do it. <laughs> I am not making this shit up. Wish I was. <laughs> Hola! Solution! I think so too, DJ Cameroni. Ik was voorheen veel creatiever met die namen van jou. Feed Newton Mouse the cheese. Fifty-nine prom. That's what this song is called. Not sure how this is gonna work out. Ah, I get why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ding dong. Got it. Flip. 
Ooh, more parts than I'm used to. That's weird. Private detective music, lava lamp. When I know more about the lava lamp, Middenweg. <laughs> I think I forgot about this one. The candle didn't light. It didn't get lit. Thank you. Launch the rocket off the top of the screen. Um. Ja. Hoe doet u dat toch, hè? Hoe doet u dat toch? Nou, dat kent het wel, hoor. Ja, dat kent het wel. I think that's it. Only this one. It's missing the outlet. Now it goes straight in the outlet. Hawa! And click and. Shout out to Marty! Party Marty, that's what they call him on the business floor. Party Marty, fix all of your bikes. Okay. 
I know the original solution to this one. But it's fun to mess around. Already tried this, I know. Alright, I'll fix it. Alright, let's backwards engineer this one. We need that soccer ball to go inside of the bucket. Though I don't have a lot of faith in this. No, that's not gonna happen. Oh, maybe this is gonna happen. the way there we go this is good fate what a junk why are we using that by the way it will land straight in it Thank you, thank you very much. Much obliged. Papa. Blow up all three blimps with the missile. Three blimps with the missile. Hmm, tough one, tough one. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's give that little kid a push. Some motivation. There we go. Only one hit of motivation. Ah, that's nasty. Oh, come on, DJ, come on. Bam, Blimper City. Oh, man, this puzzle. This really was a tough one back in the day, and now I just, well, years ahead, years later, I just figure out that you could do this, all of this, with one freaking laser. Thank <laughs> you. 
July. There we go. Put the striped ball into the bucket. Oh, I love this one. The the reuse of uh, certain parts of this level is great. Because the ball on the top goes all the way to the left and then back to the right to finish what it started. I hope you guys get what I'm doing, what I'm going for. Start the puzzle. God damn it. And it goes back to finish the job. Hoppa. Real solution is almost the same. Better landing though. My chat is stuck. So that's what's going on. Uh huh. That white went all so quiet. So Alexi says, by the way, sometimes I stalk bots old videos while he's streaming. He will probably see it later. Oh, that's okay. Heavy lag. And you were talking about... With him being one of its HD remaster promoters. Uh, it's your fault, you know that, Alexi. You made me play that awful game, which I kind of love right now. Zork 1, 2, and 3 are freeware. Why do I have those on CD? If I solve this puzzle, he would go out to his front yard to get his truck started. Cause I'm a nerd. Hey Brent Solden, uh, Kio Polo, how you doing man? I'll be having a quick toilet break and I'll be back in one minute. One minute. Shoot. 
I cannot leave you guys with this music, so. I'll be right back. Ah, my baby. So fast. Sorry for that quick interruption. Shoot the yeah, this one's quite tough because the bowling balls are in the way. Uh, it clears out just one. Nice. Though I do remember that you could flip the lamps, the lava lamps, upside down. I guess you cannot. God damn it. Cheers everybody. All that's missing at the end is a mirror, but... Hey son! How you doing man? Knock the baseball off the screen! Nine! Why? Why would this be so German? Is that a coincidence? Rockets and Germans go together, is that it? I don't know. I got no rockets uh, and Germans in my uh, inventory. Rar.
Almost. Another puzzle that's not in the original game of the Incredible Machine 2. Honestly, I have no clue what to do on this one. Perfect! <laughs> do that again. He's late. Make coffee and toast. Another one that really took me out well out yeah i think it, i remember it as i was when i was a young kid and i played a lot of them when i was a young kid and now i'm gonna finish it first attempt come on man make myself trots <sighs> and the music stuck in my head i got those lyrics in my head that fit this song, though they don't make sense at all. And it sits so gigantisch deep in me, and I weet niet waarom. And I weet niet waarom. Mm -mm. Doesn't count. I was. I almost got used. Yes, those are Rube Goldberg's machi uh, Goldberg machines. All right, so um, I think I th I'm gonna give it a go. I, I think this is it. But oh yeah, perfect! <laughs> Flip on, yes. Toast. And coffee. Ah, this is the original solution, though this one takes a little bit longer. Takes you a lot of cement and bricks, but... Yeah, this is fun because this one will bounce just over. Check this out. Oh, hey. I remember it differently though, but I thought it bounced over. Clockwork? You mean the game Clockwork? Because I do own that in a box. If I don't, I feel, if I'm not mistaken, though I barely, I don't even remember playing that. I just know that I own it. Shorty. <laughs> Check this out! All that you need to do <laughs> is blow up the blimp. <laughs> Alright, this is the original solution. There we go. Ah, that's what I mean with jumping over. That's what I remembered. Alright, my mine was way cooler than this. Make the soccer ball fall off the screen. The machine operated like clockwork. I got a game, it's for MS-DOS, it's a box and it's called Clockwork. 
I can make a picture of it real soon. It's on the attic, though. Boom! Alright, what are we gonna do with the boom? So we got light over there, let's put a solar panel next to it, a green laser. Man, I got the feeling we're aiming for the original solution. I don't like it. Very Super Mario main menu like music though. There's always more than one solution. Oi! I knew this was... Should be positioned over there, but I thought maybe... Ladies and gentlemen, there you go. Break the fish tank. But yes, Brent, there's always more than one solution. Break the fish tank. You could do that by... Oh my god, I see it now. It's so clear. Look at this. <laughs> Do it again. This is so good. Do it again. Oh, damn it. No, 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 no. I want to see that. Different, but still the same. All right, original solution. There we go. Dude, long. Dude, filled the long. Ah, oh, yes. It's the Such a waste of energy, isn't it? <laughs> oh, this one with the pinball thingy. I remember. Always fiddle a little bit with it. Hey. It's not that I can control the flipping, by the way. I'm not doing anything. Stuck in a loop. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. Nice.
That was good. Wow, that was cool, but this is it. Wait, honestly, I don't need this thing? Hey, yeah, yeah. This is gonna fail, I know, but... This is the original solution. A broken fish tank. What a mess. Oh, Start thanks. the vacuum. That's what you get when you pinball inside of the house, guys. Don't ever play pinball at your own place. I feel like backwards engineering this one. turn then use this to turn on the lamp and then I don't know yet I know, I played this a lot. I always try to find shortcuts in this game. Hop! Position this a little bit like this, a little bit lower, this one a little bit lower. That one's not adding up to the whole. Okay, this is 4th of July music. That's still not counting. A little bit more down. Yes! It adds up to the total. Oh man, that one's still missing. Yes! Purple! There we go. Purple Nurple. This one is a timing related thing, that's what I remember. It sounds like I'm talking bullshit, but I really remember most of these puzzles, not all of them. That's because I'm a bigger fan of The Incredible Machine 2 than I was of this version of the game. It's been years since I played this. Oh, yeah, 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 the hammer, the hammer. Um, you rotate this. Why not? Line it, line it, line it perfectly. That's a line up. It's not my favorite computer, my fuck it. There we go. I know my solutions are shorter. God verdikke me, quit ik snel. Ik ben hier nogal even hoor. We 
Thanks for joining me. Oh shit, I forgot the boxing glove. <laughs> Don't forget, next week, man, clear out your schedule. Raymond Legend. That's gonna be Legend Derry. Yeah, yeah. Hey, flick him I know. <laughs> Why? Shung, young, young. DJ Kammer Randapparatuur. How many puzzles did I solve? Like over 100 already. So. Young Mel. Bam, that's the first one. How to get the second one? The second one, maybe with the teeter totter, teeter totter. I hate this word, the teeter totter. You don't make that kind of shit up, right? Uh, yeah. the burnt thumb same music again congratulations Mel made it home this is the original solution such an omweg I, I know I get how this works but it doesn't work like that Oh man, the song continues on the rocket lullaby. Lullaby to music. <laughs> the rocket lullaby. To <laughs> says right here. Oh man. Speed it up, there we go. Limburg, are you ready? Now find a way to light the thing. It's all about converting energy, converting energy, and converting energy back again to the same thing. I think, I think this is it. Ah, maybe change the timer on this one. Hey, Nilos, how are you doing, bro? Oh, Mel! Met je nek? Slapen! If he falls a great distance, then he falls asleep. Help Mel get home. Help Mel get home. Oh, yeah. 
This is one that I really would take a day off for to figure out how it works because back in the day this one did get to me. Alright, that works. Put it there. Now shit gets really narrow. Um Not sure, but focus now. And the sound effects got a little bit messed up in the conversion of Tim Two to this. First attempt, hey Johnny, that's okay. Turn on the lava lamp on top of Mel's underwater laboratory. Mel be like, I don't give a shit, but all right. Mm, let's see what this does to the world. Pop. That's nasty. See that pulley there? It's hidden. Easy peasy. Blow up the nitroglycerin. The mag itself alive. Okay. It go on me. It's weird that you can convert direction of Cannonballs like this. But how are you doing, Johnny? Converting energy to other energy back to the same energy. There we go. Enjoy Princess Leia, man. Go make yourself a drink, man. I'll be here for a while, don't worry. I won't be gone if you come back. Come on, let's get hot. Almost, come on, you can do this. Come up. Bam. If you're checking out this stream, this live stream right now, do note that I do live streams like this every Monday night and I play games from back in the days. And this is quite the new game, honestly. If we compare this to other games that we played during a live stream, then this is a new one, yeah. So be sure to subscribe. And join our Discord channel. 
And if you would like to have a custom made shout out, like DJ Kama has one, like this, then let me know. Hit that join now button and see what the perks are. You get special emojis, those emojis are there to stay. Sometimes I shovel them around for some others. But they're they're in it for the long run, don't worry. This is not the original solution. But this is Another such a umweg. I get it, but it's inefficient. What the fuck? Oh, anti gravity all along. Somehow this music reminds me of um, Transport Tycoon. What's this song called? Jazzy Groove. Put the soccer ball in the car. That's my answer to a question I didn't ask for. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. Want to see something fun? And now the real solution. It's waiting for the candle to be lit. It's lit now. Bam! Jess, you're gonna fucking Jess. Yeah, I get that. I get that. Looks a lot like it. Yeah, for sure. Or what about a custom shout out like this? It's not working. Nope, it's not working. Vanavond is alles naar galamizen. That's enough to use this pipa. Terminated music. Almost. <laughs> that cannot be the original solution. Well, almost. All right. Mel's in trouble. Help him get to his house in the upper right.
I turn up to be lucky. Original solution, there we go. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. Blow up all the blimps. This one is a bitch with capital B. This one really, really is a bitch. Because some of them need to be blown up by rockets, others need to be cut up with love. Sit and out on the fucking balloon. Honestly, if you tell me that was sit on the freaking balloon. I... How come I missed that freaking reference? Come up, jongens. This is a tough one. I need those fuses to get lit. That's weird because it really hits the freaking fuse. I defuse this. That's how we do it. You have to give it a little moment. Look at this. I know the music is really good in this game. Ah, this is the original solution. Nice. Hmm. Chef Melu. Super Mario 64 music Straight up the buttocks Main menu music that is 
And now it's gone. Ah, it's too far away. For the electric motor, it doesn't really make a difference which way it's evolving, revolving, whatever. There we go. Ha! Broodje to je poot, Mel. I know because of the pan flute. Launch the rocket off the top of the screen. Yeah, uh, motion. How do we get motion? How do we get light? This is light. How do I get it there? Ah, damn it. I could have tried. The music of this game is so fantastic, guys. Yeah, you can use the mixer like this. The Oh man, that 3D graphic is great, but you can use the mixer just to adjust the aim a little bit. There we go. Right, next music track. Launch both fireworks. I always had troubles with this one because of all the diagonal things. I was like, where does what need to go and how? But I do think that the tennis ball will make it up here. Uh, we got the cannon over there. We can fire the cannon with the... You're fired! And we need a... Tin snapper. Start. Let's see what happens. Oh, 
Almost. Almost there. Hey Benjamin Gibbs, long time no see man, how you doing? Bam, that's how we do it. That's medium puzzle 41. Put the soccer ball into the wooden crate. Don't mark yourself like this one's easy though. That's because a lot of stuff only fits uh, perfectly in here. And if you guys like, I can try to use a uh, shortcut on this one. All the stuff on the bottom left, bottom right of the screen, ignore that. Ha, it works. I'm such a unique person. There we go. Tell me something I don't know yet. Will this get the soccer ball into the crate? I think so. Hey you rot up with your blimp! There we go. Alright, again, this is my solution. And now I'll show you the original solution. Well, it's not even that far off though. Both males get home and light the lamp. Hey Karen, how you doing man? It's okay. I don't expect everybody to be here on every Monday. Well, most of you, but not all of you. That's okay. I'll be here just finishing my game. I'll be here all evening. Don't forget next week, Karen. Karen, next week I'm playing Raymond Legends. And next Friday, Moxie and I will continue with Lil Nightmares number two, where we left off last time. That game is awesome. Really had us freaked out last Friday for a little. Hey, some guy. No, I didn't move. I just, I'm just sitting downstairs right now on the laptop. I can stream from multiple computers if I like. Yeah, prom music instead of porn. Alright, this one, with this one you have to be very good with pipes. And I do remember there are some shortcuts.
Whoopsie. Are we talking chainsaws? I think this is it. Karen, this is exactly the same as the incredible from Tikama, the incredible machine too. Though the puzzles look different, but they are exactly the same. Most of them, they added a few to it. There we go. That's how I finish this one. Let's see what their solution is. Oh my God, that's such an omeweg. My solution was so much cooler than this. Bam. Put the pinball into the wicker basket and activate the computer terminal. This one is really tough. I remember when I was recording this uh, a few years ago, I got a video on The Incredible Machine 2 on which I was playing this level well, I played the game from tutorial until this level and it's got almost 3 million views right now on my old channel, so... Flip. Go check that out, it's on my new channel as well, but it's only got like... One point... No, I don't... 150,000 views, I guess. Ah, that's a waste. Hey, this one. I have to figure out a way to get the pinball over to the right side in as fast as we can. Hey, we got a new Commander Keen member. Karen, welcome to the club, man. That's so lovely. It's always lovely to... Oh, that's good. It's always lovely to welcome new members to the live stream. Yeah, this is gonna... Oh, too bad. It needs to go into into the wicker basket, but that means if we put this in here. All right. Alexi, I just read your message thank you oh we made it 
You just seen all of the puzzles from tutorial right. to medium. You've solved all the medium contraptions. Time to head for the next level. Alexi. I know that Rayman Legends and all the new shit is not your thing. And tonight's uh, contraptions are kind of close to MS-DOS Gaming. So it's not the incredible machine, but it looks like it. But thank you for being here, man. I really enjoy your presence during the live streams. I know we're not playing Biomenace anymore, and that's with good reason. But of course, we'll pick a game real soon. That will be more of your liking. Because I need to return back to MS-DOS Gaming real soon. But don't forget, Alexi, if you want to see me and Moxie being spooked out a little bit, being chased by chainsaws and whatnot, then join next Friday, because next Friday we'll be continuing with the new game, Little Nightmares 2, where we left off last time, and that was suspension in the purest form. Their solution isn't that far off, though I used the Edison alligator somewhere else. Ah, they did a reshoot on this one. Ah. I think I uh, find my solution way more clever, but that's my opinion. Ben ik aan het doen joh. Kijk eens even mee joh. Nee, meewerken. Idiot tablet. Prince of Persia 1. Well, some guy, a lot of people have that problem. Be sure to hit that notification bell and see if you can turn them on manually. I get them on my wristwatch when I go live as well. Though, most of the time, I'm already aware that I'm going live. But Prince of Persia 1 isn't really my thing. Send somehow. off the fireworks. Yes. Oh, it's another one that I was anticipating on. I thought this was the one with Mel, but we already did that. Mel on the pier. Alright. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Duly note that we are doing the hard puzzles right now. That means the game gets a bitch right now. But for real. Do know that if you join uh, the YouTube channel as a member right now and you want your own custom animated shout out and join in on uh, the Jazz Gravity, you won't regret it. I hate promoting the channel like this, but let's see, I got this button right. No, it doesn't work like that. Press this, press that. Tonight, everything works a little bit different. There we go. Niet slecht, niet slecht. What's the original solution? That is the original solution. Set off the fireworks on the left side of the screen. Things that go boom.
Yeah, from here on out the game gets really tough and this these are the hard puzzles and after that you get the really hard puzzles and those those are not a walk in the park yet yeah, really have to have some experience on this game do you want to finish those levels without any troubles or even with troubles fish tanks and help curry cat exit the right side of the screen I wonder if any of those buttons bounce around when you solve Microsoft Solitaire <laughs> well this this shiny shimmering kind of button that was so well end of 90s this game is from 2000 so that's not surprising all right destroy Destroy all of them. Clip. That's enough. That's enough. Flip. Boom. One, two, three, four. All right, let's. Momentum! Yes, that's how you do it. <laughs> good night, have a good night of sleep, Karen, and see you next time. I even wrote down your, uh, your birthday, though I don't remember it right now. Wel weet ik wie de woensdagjarig is. Is het smash? Is het dash? Het is smash? Het is dash? Oh, my solution is so much cooler. Ik zeg woensdag, maar ja, dat klopt. Woensdag. Ah, dat hou ik voor mezelf. Is there a way? to punch the cheese of course there's always a way to punch cheese Aww, Bert Visser 1994 Feast on the cheese, mother. Make a cup of coffee. This one is a very, very narrow puzzle. Uh, okay. Click and on. Damn it, you apple mouse. Right. 
trying to get that blue laser in here. The other way, guys. That's a hit. En dan niet van die andere hazes rommel, maar gewoon een goede hit. Yeah, shit is getting serious right now, guys. It's a pest that those belts don't work on long distance. They won't connect. Steel cable. Wrong prisoner. Boxing glove to pop the balloon. Ah. 
Ja. Ja, bijna. Hoppa! Goodbye, Sid. Fire is a laser. It's limbo time. Yeah, toil. The puzzle look of my face, yeah. That's how to get the ball rolling and then what? Yeah, yeah. Untrustable, of course, I'm still playing this. Both of the balloons. We already finished the tutorial. We played a few levels from The Incredible Machine. We played The Incredible Machine 2 for a little bit. We played Sid and Al's amazing Incredible 2 machine. And of course, the main game of the night is The Return of The Incredible Machine, also known as Contraptions. We did the tutorial, the easy, the medium puzzles. Now we're working on hard, also known as difficult. And uh, yeah, that's best moeilijk. Yeah, that mag je eerlijk weten. Maar it's a good thing that I remember most of them from when I was a kiddo. Heel volhoudend in ieder geval. Ja. That's how we roll. Laser coffee time. Yeah, I remember this one being a bitch with the lasers. Uh, duh. Right, this ball is to turn them on and the other seven mirrors are to bend them in the right way. And that's quite lastig. Um, I remember this one taking me hours back in the day to finish. We need all three. 
of the lasers inside of that mixer. Almost. Alright, one more pixel up. One more pixel up. And that's red. There we go. Alright, time to connect blue to the party. That should be blue. Alright, that means we already have purple. We got three mirrors left. Hey, purple gorilla, how are you doing, man? Now I'm quiet where my laser heen gaat. Ah, there. Oh, this music. Come on! Goodbye, Mr. Coffee Pot. Put the bowling ball into the cardboard box. Mmm. This incredible machine hoedown. There are no dogs in this game. Wat een vieze viespeuk opmerking. <laughs> How do you mean I like him young? <laughs> I just love watching old Daisy dance with this little tiny. Oh, it's not plugged in. There we go. By the way, it will be going the other way. Het geeft niet, Kama. Ik weet dat het van een smerige plek, een goede plek komt. Hou je in. <laughs> Alright, only the rockets drop. That means we could use something to light that fire below the rocket. How come they don't destroy the balloon? Though, if you, you you probably missed this, but earlier tonight we figured out that this is Sid's face from Sid and L's tune machine. How fucking cool is that? A critic squammer may, and we were like, I was like, really? Yes, really. Yeah, it is beer time, but it's toilet time as well. Ah, ne, dan heb ik hem. Something less pervy like that. All right, cool. Radler shoot him, bro. Oh, netjes, zeker door de weekse avond. Die hebben wij ook in huis. Ja, yeah, maybe connect them this time. The ball still has to fit below it. Yes! 
great moment for me to go to the, to visit it's the boys time. room. But I'll leave you with something cool. Something cool. Um, this one. Alright. Yes, we should chat on Discord after this, but I'll be back in... I don't know. A minute. Give me a minute. One minute break, guys. I'll be right back. There I am. Time to toast roast. That's a tactic that I use all the time. Just click the play button and see what happens. But thank you for the beer, Untrustable. Ik, ik maak hem ook echt nu net open. It's so much appreciated. This should do it. And I got a brand. Still had those in the fridge, and I was like, "Yeah, I'd like the, I, I'd like one of those." Help! Cure. And the game doesn't show hints anymore. Oh, well, it still does show Carefully hints. Carefully placed explosives could do a double duty. I thought the game would stop showing hints from now on. Well. From the difficult level on. <laughs> the real bee. <laughs> 
It's 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 fine stuff. I Yes, that's it. The cheese level. Hoe ging die ook weer? Candles out and wait. Hoppa, there goes the cheese. Launch. There's no floor in this level. Up. Mm. We'll launch the mouse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We forgot to launch the rocket off the screen, but. That's how you do it. Danger blimp. Oh man, the game is getting tougher and tougher all the time right now. Let's tie that bucket to something. Pompeian Rhapsody So you got that candle that moves all around the the Rhapsody Purple Gorilla, thank you man That means a lot, you know that Be sure to subscribe and consider getting a membership if you get your membership, Purple Gorilla, you can get a animated shout out custom made like one of these or one of these or one of these or one of these. Just playing all of them right now.
And I make them by hand, so... And don't forget, I am here to play games every Monday night. Every week on the Monday. I think this should do it. Alright, it's lit. Blow up the blimp before it can get off the screen. All right, before it, <laughs> if it gets off this, the screen. That's a complex one. Maybe we should let it stay forever. Let it stay forever. Sometimes it's just measuring what fits where and you already know how to solve a puzzle halfway. And rockets don't only have to be launched, sometimes you can just fling them in a direction to get what you like. Mm. Boom! Break the Cheers, everybody. and put Curie Cat into the cardboard box. Not going the right direction. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see it now. Boom! That's how you put a cat in the box. Get the Uh, this one is okay. I remember this one. This one ain't that tough. Fix that. Not sure who came to mind to remove that part from the equation. That's a great place to make some coffee. See if we can get the mouse so gek that he drop fall.
What's the real solution? Ah, they use more pulleys, but the the outcome is uh, it's a bit sturdy, but it's almost the same. It's almost the same. All right, it's time for Mel on the move. That means we get to shoot through boxes. I remember this one. It's so American, the music. Sit down, dog. Oh, don't drop a hog in the parts bin. You'll be forever trying to find it. Don't drop a hog in the parts bin. This, uh, by the way, is the parts bin. <laughs> Did you know that if you play this game on Halloween or on uh, Christmas or St. Patrick's Day question mark then you get to play this game with some extra pods might you want to build your own puzzle back in the day I was all about building my own puzzle so I've seen that a lot I schiet ik hem nou recht op het dak sukkel bam Damn. Uh, we have to reposition this a little bit to the left and this one should be positioned a little bit lower. That's our solution. If Mel falls from two well, from a great height, he might fall asleep. You don't want that. Turn on the can opener. The mic shovel, I think. Okay. Oh, where did the mouse go? Where does the mi mouse go? There's no need for the boxing glove, by the way. Wait, 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 I haven't found a way to light the lamp yet. Rock that. For you, I would all the steaks. All the All the Uh, all right. Edison alligator, do your magic. Flip. Ah, god damn it. Yeah. 
Kama. Slap that, come on. Make the balloon go off the top of the screen. And what did I do? It went off on the left, right side of the screen. Damn it! Well, it technically it did went off on the top side of the screen. Good spell. The switch. Why doesn't he enter the hole? Ah, uh, the cat needs to get there and it was stuck. And there's nobody, the Ave said, Hey Bart, you did gewoon goed. Get Mel or any of his friends to the house. To the house. Ooh. Only one of them? No explosion. Groet aan Isis. Gek op katten. Je weet het. Only one of the males needs to get there. Why not this one? Different Mel. Different solution. Set off the fireworks. Ah. Okay. I think I can do that. Oh, well, there's already so much stuff happening. Mel grinding my gears. I think that's it. 
same here at Trustable Zero. I'm gonna finish off these difficult levels. And then that's gonna be it for me, though I'll be here to play another round of 3D Ultra Pinball, of course. Yes, why the fuck not? We're playing Sierra games tonight, so. Fire the laser. Fire the laser. Fire the laser. Fire the laser. Marley Lantje. Afke, shout out. It spite me. Yeah, it spite me. Good evening, Molain. How was Valentine's Day? Am I lying? Next Friday, Moxie and I are gonna continue on Little Nightmares 2. So be sure to, to grab a bottle of wine before that happens. And. Next Monday, I'm playing Raymond Legends. Ah, video chat with friends. Nice. That's always nice. I think you'll like Raymond Legends as well. I need this. Hop. Hoppa, weg met je ballonnen. This is like the weirdest thing ever. It's barely upgraded when you look at the 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 original. We check out the information. This big granite archway can be used to fill spaces so objects can pass through. You can set things on top of it or bounce things off of it. But you can blow it up. So these are like this is like a square wall. Even the inner part is is nothing and you cannot blow it up so let's use it as a floor. <laughs> My line in the building I've already been flipping stuff over. Flip 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 flip. Well that's been happening all evening, don't worry. Ah ik moet Goodbye Mr. Bucket. Yeah. Should this do it? I don't think so. I am probably forgetting about something like a way to get this. Uh, Fired up. Come on, we can do this. DJ, come on. That's nasty. The Incredible Machine is an incredibly tough game and the reason I am playing this so easily is not because I played this one that much, no. I played a lot of The Incredible Machine 2 which features like 90% of the puzzles that are in this game so and they're the same, they just have a little different appearance man. This one, this motherfucker got me stuck years ago. I had issues on this puzzle for a long long time curry the cat you mean 
Yeah, this is something that just doesn't work in my head, but look at this. There are honestly a lot of physics in the game that I have to question, but this one... I never got this one. See that the bullet ends there, behind after the corner, it ends. But if I do this, look what happens, look what happens. It comes out just below this. It's not even lined up that well. Look. That's, that's weird because it doesn't come out of the... Sometimes it does. I just don't get it. Just don't get it. Yeah, what new? Is there any more space for a magnifying glass? I think I can position those on the wall. Somebody earlier tonight said, already commented on that. Why does some of them go on a different layer than others? That's just how the incredible machine works, I guess. What am I forgetting about? There are scissors, scissors. I see. This needs to explode to set shit in motion. There we go. This is it. This explosion doesn't want to explode. Took us a minute or two, but there we go. Make the rocket fly off the top of the screen. That was one of the toughest difficult puzzles there is. Unless you count the, the uh, billiards levels. Those are the worst. Alright, I think this should be positioned right there. There's no rope. How do we do this? Questionable. 
already have issues getting this. Oh, what the fuck? Why doesn't this work? There's something wrong with that. Make the rock. Why doesn't this connect? I've never seen that happen. Click on the Make the rock. Hey. What? That's weird. It's like it's not part of the solution. Sure, fine. I, I, I guess some guy. I have to admit, it's been a few years since I played this. But it's weird, where's my, my freaking freedom? There we go. That's how we do it. That's a weird form of hinting, right? Because there are no real hints for this puzzle. what the solution is. We need to find a way 
But it doesn't push it any further than that. Yeah, of course. Make it pop earlier. There we go. This is it. This is like the perfect solution. All right, real solution. They use the cogs differently. Even I use the shortcut on this one. Put the two ball into the middle pocket at the bottom of the screen and then put the three ball into the top left corner pocket. So this one needs to go here and the two ball needs to go there. These puzzles are the toughest. I'm going to repeat myself for the fourth time tonight. The normal balls like tennis balls and, and baseballs, they suffer from normal gravity. And the billiards suffer from, well, experience top-down gravity. So. Do with that whatever you want. Incredibly tough. That's why it's called the incredible machine. <sighs> That's exactly what I needed to do. Heel goed. That was lucky. I remember when I was a kid when that took me... Well... If I say weeks, then I'm not exaggerating. Sometimes I would boot up the old 486. And then I'd be like, mm, Am I gonna play Transport Tycoon? Or am I gonna try to figure out where I got stuck and how to fix it on The Incredible Machine 2? Hmm? Hey, you need that on. You don't want that, you want it to light the match. Curry the cat. Pew! Spooking mice since... 1992. Uh, four. I know, Arinao, this is the incredible machine the return of, also known as Contraptions, from 2000, so it's a little bit more polished, like this game is really from the Windows XP era. Flip! Cut. But I played all of them tonight, all for a little bit, and played this one the most. This one was on the schedule for the night.
nice. En waarom niet dan? Waarom niet? Waarom niet? Waarom niet? Waarom niet? Waarom niet? Return to the castle of the incredible machine. Ja, bijna. Mm, satisfaction. Make some Late for breakfast. Make some toast and launch the balloon. Honestly, if I have to choose between this version and the Incredible Machine 2, then that's an easy choice. I'm a big fan of the Incredible Machine 2. Though, you have to know that I love this version as well. This one is exactly the same, though it has a few extra levels, but they're not even mention worthy. So many there are. Not much. And yeah, the music's good on this version, absolutely. That's because it's CD audio, it's very good. Thanks some guy, thank you for joining and hope to see you next Monday when I play Rayman Legends. The stream has already been announced, be sure to give that a like after this stream ended. You might be redirected to that. That's well the bedoeling. I'm trying. Now it doesn't cut it. Yes! Now we get both of it. Hmm. Make some toast. We haven't made the toast yet. Needs to launch backwards. I'm not. I wish I was. Still here Fire playing the games. And put That's for sure. Then we need to figure out what it needs to power. This powers that, and that will power the, the match, I think. That will light the cannon. Not the candelon, that's not a word. You can try and make it a word, but. that's missing is this so the ja dan moet je het wel erin proppen niet ernaast
Ah, there we go. That's it. You need to position the laser perfectly. Now I want to see the original. Oh my god, that's way. Well, it's almost the same. It is the same. I think we have to do three more after this. This one looks easy, you don't have a lot of parts, it doesn't look that complex. I think we can do this within a minute. If it launches in there, how do we launch it in there with the... Because uh... nobody likes curry. Within a minute, guys. Yeah? That's perfect! That is the real solution. Almost the same. Wow, this artwork, you gotta love it, it's so American, but the whole game is quite American. So the gun will fire at the hedge clippers, hedge trimmers, my bad. The hedge trimmers will make the smile balloon float up, that will power the red laser, the red laser will Power the blue laser and the blue laser will power the green one? And that will power the lava lamp. Uh, which is never powered by an outlet but always powered by a rope. Pulling the rope. And then we need to get the balloon, and there we go. God damn it, son. How come it misses the outlet? Suck it. Nice. That was Help easy. Now get to the right side of the floor at the bottom of the screen. Right side of the floor at the bottom of the screen. So he needs to go here. Uh. Okay. It's a weird, weird question, but I'll do it. This is fun, because the tennis balls need to, to push each other, but not like that. Gaussian gun. He won't fall to the spring. He will flip around. Yeah, there we go. We made it, man. We made it. I think we need to do one more puzzle, but I'm not sure. Make the, Make the smiley face balloon fly off the top of the screen. Well, the hedge trimmers are already there. More from. Home Alone is already there. You only got these? Honestly, is this an expert level? 
Or well, difficult level? This is like the easiest difficult level there is. Launch the rocket off the top of the screen. Yeah, this one is kind of tough because I do barely remember this one. This is one I, I should look up if I don't get through it. Flips the switch. The switch powers this thing. Damn it. I don't have any more items to... Nice, now hit the switch too. Almost got both of them, come on. Almost, to make Mel run. Light beam back. Hmm. I've never seen that happen. Oh, 
I don't even remember remotely how to fix this one. Really wouldn't know. Maybe this makes more sense to do. Right? Getting there, don't worry. You just conquered the very last of the difficult contraptions. So now it's time to polish off the expert contraptions. No, I think that's enough contraptions for 
tonight. <laughs> Slap like a pa. I think that's enough of the incredible machine for tonight. But before we start playing games tonight, we have Lady Ultra. Ultra Thrill Ride. Papa. Same developers. Let's head for the Thrill Zone. I remember my best friend had this on his computer and I was I was amazed by how it looks though the the it's weird because pinball tables need to have a certain length and these just don't have that I'm hungry. let's go to the snack bar that well, it bothers me. Yes, it did bother me, but it should cool. be because it's Excellent. really fantastically made. But for real, it's a great pinball table. Let's head for the thrill zone. But it's so weird. Thrill ride. But it's so well made. I got the brass ring. The only reason, oh my god, black tutor are on. Sticky keys are on, still on on this computer. The only reason that I don't feature a gameplay video of this game on my YouTube channel is that I just don't Those feel will cut down on the wait time. that I'm good enough. <laughs> I'm not worthy. Wow, awesome skill, dude. Snacks and gifts. Diet soda. Today is your lucky day. Today is my lucky day indeed. Clover cars. Use the ball to knock them into the target. Do it again. Do it again! Hit the bumper cards. This was everything that everybody hoped that Rollercoaster Tycoon 1 and 2 looked like, you know? This was how it looked like in your head. Though there's nothing wrong with Have how Rollercoaster 1 and, and 2 look like Rollercoaster Tycoon. I'm hungry. Let's go to the snack bar. But it's... it's... It, it's... this is... Ah, you know what I mean. Let's say that if Chris Sawyer from Rollercoaster hey, Tycoon, if he worked together with the makers, producers of this game, I think they could have made something mind-blowing for the 90s. Trying 
to hit the target to make a big splash. No. Damn you sticky keys. That's a way to do it. Hurry up, time is running out. And I messed up. Almost hit the merry-go-round. You never really play roller coaster tycoon. Marlijntje, jij krijgt huiswerk. This. <laughs> Wat is dit nou? I got stuck balls. And it's loose. I love the real live action footage on the bottom left of the screen. And that the drill song looks different now. Do it again! That's a roller coaster instead of a log flume. Do it again! Do it again! Not even sure what I'm aiming for, but now it goes back to a wooden roller coaster. Also known as I got the last ring! What? You still got the CD. I'm game over, would you like to play again? That's what the game says, but I don't think you can see the message. No, you guys can see that. Searching for a nice song. Ah, there it is. Everybody, we played a little bit of The Incredible Machine 1, three puzzles. We played a little bit of The Incredible Machine 2, four puzzles. And we played a little bit of Citadel's Incredible 2 Machine, one puzzle. And then we figured out that The Return of the Incredible Machine Features balloons, even the Incredible Machine 2 features balloons with Sid's face on it. I never found that reverence. I always thought that that was Lumpy from Happy Tree Friends, which didn't exist yet, which looks totally different, but that's on me. For now, everybody, we played. The Incredible Machine, the return of the Incredible Machine contraption, not the even more, but the normal one from the year 2000, which was implemented in the Hoyle world and also known as Hoyle Puzzle and Board Games 2005 was probably the first one, then until 2000, though that was the last one, I don't even remember. But we played the tutorial puzzles, easy puzzles, medium puzzles, and even the difficult puzzles. The only thing that we didn't do were the expert puzzles, but those 
are really, really tough to do. But for now, I'd love to thank all of you for being a part of it tonight. After this live stream, you will be redirected to my next live stream, which will be next Friday. Friday, I will be continuing on a Little Nightmare 2, the new game that's really cringy. It's like Limbo and it's like Inside. And I've been playing that along with Moxie and man, last Friday, that was amazing. That really spooked us a little bit. It was really cool. So I can't wait to see what part two of that game of part two is featuring what it has in store for us so if you want to be part of that be sure to join next Friday 8 o'clock 9 o'clock ish somewhere in between on the Friday night European time and don't forget every Monday night I'll be playing those games or anything related like this but for now thank you for being a part of it it's an adventure it's an adventure every time and I love doing it Good night. Ha, ik zeg wel good night, maar we moeten klikken dan.